Dermot, since you came here, you've tried to identify a training ground base for the club, and, and, and we've got one now here, and, and working in partnership with the Sikh community. Yeah, fantastic. We had a lovely reception this morning. Uh, I think it's very interesting to learn about the cultures. They're really nice people, um, and you can see behind us the tranquility of the environment that we want to bring the boys into, and uh, we're going to get started on the pitches literally tomorrow. Um, and this really come about, I was I met three bridges and then I went around the uh, town with Johnny Ems in his motor looking at sites and we come across this and we sort of jumped over the gate and I really liked it and I said to John, John knew uh, Barry Munn. And, Former uh, club secretary at Crawley, yeah, yeah. And so John got in contact and it was literally John into Barry and then Kelly Durham's done some great work and got it over the line for us. So it's really important uh, the help that the local people have here just by picking up the phone, picking up the phone we're, we're in. And I'm really, really pleased. And uh, the Sikh community are, are, are really embracing this partnership as well. They've given you a nice orange, one of their orange scarves to wish the club good luck. Yeah, it's going to go in the boardroom and it's a spiritual scarf and it's, uh, they give it with all sincerity, you know, so I hope it does bring us luck. Probably more come away maybe and uh, we'll, we'll keep it in the boardroom and, and look after it. And the facilities themselves, uh, you're still going to be based at the ground, but you're mm. going to be coming here on a daily basis, yeah. that's right. What is it, 10 minutes or yeah, so? Yeah, less than 10 minutes. Five yeah. the way Kelly drives. <laughs> but um, we're going to refurbish the ground, so we're going to make sure the, the dressing rooms are OK. We're going to get the analyst department up and running. The this is back at the stadium. Back at yeah. the stadium, yeah. So the boys will do all their work there, and then they'll come down here to train, and then when they go back, they'll do work again. You know, So it's, uh, it's as good as we can get, in my opinion, for, to get us uh, our own base. I think this is the fourth training ground the club have had in the Football League. Mm. Hopefully now we're based here in terms of training for a long time. Yeah, I hope the, the longevity of the, the relationship is good um, and that the, the, you know, the presence put a lot of work in to support the club and it's hopefully we're, we're turning things around quickly. We're signing players, uh, we're trying to improve it all. We're, we're, we're running as fast as we can. Uh, and I just, I'm really pleased at the moment. I want to, I can't wait just really to get the football side. I'm doing all these things with Matt and Kelly that we don't normally do, but it's, uh, it's been challenging, but uh, uh, successful at the moment. Only three weeks now till the boys are back. Yeah, uh, but yeah, none of them are answering their phones. <laughs> I think they're all on the beach. Uh, but we're, we're getting the squad together quickly, and the new signings are imminent. Um, we're trying to get the philosophy of the club over to everybody, so the staff, the working staff in Kelly's office and always know what we're all about and trying to empower the club with a uh, everyone wants to come to work you know and do it 